if I was Apple right now, I would probably be pissed right now. We have probably the most affirmative report that Apple is indeed working on a foldable device, but it may not be the type that you're thinking about. Not only that, but who actually leaked that Apple is working on that foldable device? There is an event going on right now in Korea where all the big tech heads are there right now. They're showing off new devices or whatever. And at this conference or this event, they did leak that Apple is working on a foldable device and you won't believe who that source is i will tell you that in this article apple's first foldable laptop just leaked and you won't believe the source yes but before we get into who that source is if you are new to this channel and enjoy this type of content please do me a huge favor hit that subscribe button don't forget to hit that notification bell and hit the like button as well if you like this video all right let's dive into this article again apple's first foldable laptop leaked and you won't believe the source. Now, this is an article out of iMore.com. Apple is, again, rumored to be hard at work on its first foldable device, but it won't be a phone like Samsung or Google's latest and greatest. Instead, it will be a laptop as suggested by prior leaks. Yes, like so many of the leaks of this kind, this one comes via Apple's supply chain. And let's talk about who that supply chain is. But the company that leaked it, it might surprise you because it's a household name. Yes, it's one of the, it's, and it's one that you wouldn't expect to be involved in leaking information from about upcoming products. But all that said, here we are. And Samsung, Samsung of all the people, appears to have leaked that is working with Apple on a new 20 inch foldable computer yes you see it right there samsung leaked that they are working with apple on this so let's continue to read this article uh samsung like other companies is currently at sid review event in yolks yolk sign business sector in south uh south korea during the event patently apple reports that the samsung let slip that something's afoot yes but not only did Pat and the apple reported i think samsung mo sam mobile website as well as well as um, times guide and laptop magazine so there are a number of credible sources out there that are reporting this so this seems like it is very legitimate according to the reports it was revealed that apple is currently working on a 20 inch foldable it product project with samsung and lg display so the reason why they work with samsung and lg is because they're going to be providing the screens for those devices as we know samsung and lg provides many of the screens so a lot of manufacturers out there as apple doesn't develop their own screen so samsung previously said that it is expected apple to get into the foldable laptop market in 2024 although more recent reports suggest that 2026 is a it's the time frame we should be looking forward. Yeah, 2024, Apple is not creating any type of foldable device. Uh, 2026 does sound more realistic. As Again, Apple likes to play the waiting game, so they're you know, waiting for um, other things to line up as well. When discussing the foldable plans with Apple, this time around, Samsung said that it is aware of reliability issues with the currently afflict foldable displays, including buckling, crackling, and the effect of impacts from things like drop um, style, styling. Uh, there are all things that Samsung and LG will need to work on if they want to put their displays into future affordable Apple devices. So again, Apple is waiting. They're waiting for things to be perfected because Apple likes to put out these products that are pristine and and it has that Apple touch, that Apple flair to it. And right now, I guess they're they're not confident in how foldable devices are working at this point especially with the screen as you know we are having issues with foldable devices but the screen is deteriorating so that is something that does need to be worked on but you can't uh you know uh advance or proceed if you don't actually make the products and bring them to market so you can test them out or see how they actually work in consumers hands um so apple is letting everybody else do the work uh, Apple's focus on a 20 inch notebook rather than a phone might be counter to what other companies are doing, but it could make for an interesting product. Could the display open out and be a large uh, tablet or sorts, but turns into a laptop with a touch keyboard uh, what needed? I don't know. Uh, time will tell at the rate. Samsung might be Apple to announcing this thing properly as well. Yeah, so that's pretty much it. Yeah, so. We already seen other manufacturers out there, Lenovo with their yoga yoga notebooks. They have the the foldable touchscreen, so th they are pretty impressive. Again, we're we'll be waiting to. I think all the world is awaiting Apple's entry into the foldable market. 
again, again, um, when they do enter the market, we know that people will go crazy over it. Apple does have that fur and have that touch to make people go crazy, just like they did recently with their Vision Pro uh, VR AR headset. So it will have that Apple touch to it, Apple design. So I would be interested to see that, but I think that's again, a couple of years, a few years away from Apple actually entering the market. So it's still in a waiting game at this point, but again, we do have what I what appears to be a very uh, firm um, source, very firm report that Apple is indeed working on a foldable uh, a device as well. Yeah, I don't think, and I think I said it's in a previous video, I don't think Apple will make a foldable phone. I, I don't think so. I think they'll go somewhere like a foldable laptop or a foldable tablet or something like that, or a hybrid of the two. I think they'll just probably just leave the phone market to to be dominated by, you know, Samsung at this point and others at this point, you know, OnePlus, uh, Huawei, Xiaomi, they're all making great phones. Oppo with their foldable phones and then obviously um, Google with their uh, Pixel Fold as well. So it's a lot of players in that market. Um, it will be interesting what to see what Apple could do if they enter the market. But we know they do have a dedicated audience that will eat up their devices as soon as they release it. So Apple will do well if they release the device, but will they bring anything that would be innovative or different from what other people are doing? That remains to be seen. But let me know what your thoughts on or about hearing this um, news that Apple is indeed getting into the foldable market with probably a foldable laptop. What are your thoughts on that? Do you believe that Apple will do this? And are you interested in a foldable laptop or tablet from Apple? Let me know down in the comment section. Thank you once again for taking the time out to watch this video. If you enjoyed this video, please do me a huge favor, hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to hit that notification bell and hit that like button as well. And if you want to stay up to date with the latest tech news, head over to soundsnerdy.com where I curate and aggregate tech news from around the web covering Apple, Samsung, Android, Google, computing, and even more tech news all at the website soundsnerdy.com. And until the next video, guys, stay nerdy.